guys just enjoyed movies, and today I'm going to keep it relatively short, but SMP episode 28. In this video, I'll be making a lucrative trade deal with Infinite. Quinn will be punished for moving so far away, and I'll attempt to assassinate the stealer of my sword. Plus, even more. Keep watching. First time in this video, I did an okay-ish deal with Infinite, and Quinn showed me some texture packs that I would need to try. Uh, I got a Nether and Ingot, and I'll give you... about two, uh, a Nether Ingot and five diamonds for the light show. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Uh, sure. What was the original deal? 36 diamonds? Uh, yeah. But uh, here, actually, let's do this. Nether and Ingot. Nether ingot, um, netherite scrap, and three diamonds. Actually, two diamonds. We're out, we're out of town. Uh, yo, uh, sir, Nerf yo. dude has joined VC. What a rarity. You wanna go do it, sir? Uh, you know what? Sure. Oh, oh, um, okay, that was awkward. Uh, we're talking about I will sell infinite my backup elytra for some diamonds and netherite. Right now, I'm gonna make myself an iron farm. Where the fuck are your boots? I took them off because uh, cause I was in the nether and I had gold boots, but they broke. I think they're in my okay. ear chest. That is like okay. the worst thing you can do. Okay. I think the best thing you can do, remove is probably your helmet. Hold on, let me go grab my elytra from the other shulk box. Yeah. Well, I'll check. Yeah, hold on. That's that's what I'm doing. And yeah, do you have a breaking three mending book? I'm breaking three and mending, or breaking two or mending. But what for the pleasure? Oh, uh, hold on. Uh, I think it's in my other. Do you have that other shop box? Alright, uh, I'll take Bro, take. It's, it's not in there, but I, uh, it's in your chest. Or not in your chest, it's in your house. Try, I try. I want you to put on the sound pack. One second, bro. Okay. Uh, scary monsters. That's it. Uh, Wait, the... can I kill it? I need a. Well, but I don't hear the the mobs. Hold on. The creeper sound is the same. Yeah, the creeper still sounds the same. Um. Oh, but the. Spider. I think. Okay. Uh, the the zo the zombie is definitely different. And I think the skeleton. Okay, real talk. That sound literally comes out of Michael Zombies. If you see my Michael Zombies video from a while back, you know what I'm talking about. But this sound literally sounds like one of the zombies from Michael Zombies. Could have said it. Dude, I can't wait to just turn around oh, to just geez. hear this randomly and turn around and see a baby zombie on a chicken. Head towards, head towards the end. Flash. I'm right now at the end gateway. Okay. I hope you're videoing this. I am. Uh... Now, Chori, I want you to go and attack. Um. Yeah, I'll do what I do best. Get killed. Okay, the Enderman just idle sound is scary, but what if I attack it? Oh my! We're oh no! Oh no, nah, bro! I'm out of here! I'm out of here, bro! Nah, bro! That's also on my end. I have a bloody texture pack for the Enderman, so literally the Enderman look like. Hold on, let me get a screenshot. No, send me the texture pack. Okay, so you remember in last episode when Quinn just moved out of his house randomly to some place far away where. We would not be able to get him. Well, we didn't even have his cords in that video. But now we've been on a hunt to find his cords. And it's been panning out results. But what should we do with Quinn since we do have his cords? I mean, I guess we can ask him. Well, I know he's going to say no because he already built his surroundings, I guess. Really jump to the threats because look, if you do that, you're gonna start drama. All of our bases are gonna get destroyed because of one of your decisions. And the server's gonna die off because all of our bases are gone. But actually, so no one would uh, make teams or make their base. As somewhere. 
I just don't find it useful to go immediately to like physical action. I feel like a threat would be just fine because if we make it believable enough, then yes. Yeah, so, like, you know. Alright, so we can do this. Uh, you can ask him however, however many times you want to ask him. Just when he says no and you think that it's time for me to, you know, mine his face down, just tell me it and then I'll do it. So we waited. And the time did eventually come. We found his base, traveled to it, and he was not happy. You're lagging, Ella. Oh, I said your house cords got doxxed. I want to say doxxed, but Lord, they went out and found it. But what happened was, as I went to go make a lag machine, essentially put them in the finger end, and which they did to me. So then they got on the hole in a hissy fit. Right? And, and I was saying, I just want to be left alone. And then they started sort of blaming me for breaking a rule. I'm just like, well, I left because you guys steal from me, which I have another person who's saying, yes, people do steal from him. And guess what? People were stealing from me when I was in that little village area, you know, before I moved. moved and, and then afterwards, I, I, I really have to go into the definition of stealing because because Thomas was saying, "Oh, what I did was a stealing, taking your stuff, trading them for emeralds, and then and then actually go to go like, oh, it's an automatic farm. It doesn't matter. I'm like, dude, you still stole from me. Okay, so they they they, they actually stole a netherite. They they stole a netherite upgrade template from me because I only had two, and then magically one disappears, and I still have diamond tools, and then. It's ever so often I notice some little shit like, like some building or even some like, like cobblestone, wood, sticks, some wool. Alright, sorry for the really quick intermission here, but if you could please subscribe to this channel, that would be really helpful. We upload new videos a lot, and uh, we're trying to get to 500 subscribers, so if you could please help us in the goal, that would be nice. While this was all going on, I was doing some upgrades to my bows and swords to get them better in chain. And it was actually doing quite well. All that my sword needs to be maxed out is Unbreaking 3 and Fire Aspect 2. So, I'm gonna be enchanting for a while to get one of those. Oh, by the way, uh, Daniel over here uh, adding his things together made me realize that these two bows that I have can be combined in order to make a max bow, and I had the levels for it. So things were pretty good for me. And then I got this message from Commander Lack. Now, obviously, I said yes because I, uh, you know, I'm the master of death, and I don't care about losing a couple levels, and they'll give me all my stuff back. Right.
Well, it seems that Daniel had taken some of my stuff when I had been his test subject. How mean. I had to go in and assassinate him for what he did. Of everything you know that you could get. Don't let them guide your life towards regret. I'll fight for what I love with every breath. My past is filled with things I won't forget. Dang, just missed him. I'll have to go in for another strike. So treat the worst of times just like a test. If only I could go back in time. Well, crisis averted, I guess. There is a lot more enchanting stuff that I'll put on the screen right now. Me getting max bows and a bunch of junk and backup stuff. But it's not really necessary to talk about all that in depth. And instead, I think we're just going to end the video. So if you guys enjoyed it, smack the like button. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Make sure to single George Movies upload. Make sure to follow me on Twitch. Subscribe to the second channel. All that. See ya. Bye.